Hey, we're back! This is Ace Master playing Shadow Dragon, and today we are finally, finally, finally going to get around to, to going through Chapter 8. This has been a very slow playthrough just because I've been lazy! No, I've had work. Work has been pretty tough in general, but... Oh, mm. That should help a little. So, last time we left off, we finished chapter. Well, we did finish chapter seven. I don't remember what happened, but we have reached Arcanian soil, um, and they're resting in Port Morin, a uh, town known for commerce. They basically uh, pay a lot in taxes, but they don't have to get taken over and oppressed. And then. Um, Yeah, so the idea is that they're going to attack the city for some reason, and it's just like, okay. Um, we're gonna get more people. For obvious reasons. We get Penvo. I don't know what that means, but okay. Um, so up here we have a bunch of cavaliers, a bunch of horse people, Bunch of uh, armor people, bunch of archers. Yeah. Um, and then over here is Cannibal, a knight. Um, and he drops Levin Sword, which is nice. If any of my sword users actually had any sort of magic stat. Well, Wendell has one magic, ain't that grand? Yippee Kaye. Cheetah still has zero magic, which is completely ridiculous. I hope that she actually gets better because it would be a pain. Um. So we're just gonna do the standard stuff for the Mounted people go in the back. And Drow goes to the front. And am I out of um am I out of fire? Okay, we need fire. What we could do is just warp to the boss and leave, but that's kind of... We have so many units we need to baby up, so we're just going to have to do the inefficient playthrough stuff. Bantu, I might just bench after a while, because only, having only 30 uses means I can barely use him at all. He gets like one more firestone around chapter 20 something. Actually that's that's passable. Uh, first we need to trade Penvo's iron bow out. And we're gonna put uh give Sheeta the physics staff. Just in case. Wendell's almost out of steel sword uses. Martha's almost out of iron. Um, so is Julian, so what we can do is we can do a merge and have this iron sword merge with Marth's iron sword. So that goes up some nice amount. And then Marth can use one of the infinite number of iron swords in the convoy. Um, so there's that. Abel's nice, Kain's nice. Uh, we're running out of heals, so... Let's store that. Oh. Let's buy her another one, then. Um, I'll buy a spare. And... Might as well. 
Oh, that's enough. Uh, oh yeah, and the fire for Barst. Oh no, he's actually not out of fire. He's out of thunder. Oh well. Any forges to do? Um, hard to say. I kind of want to give Barst a extra whatever, but nah. So let's just get started. So we are going to be joined by Caesar and Rad now. Um, except they're all the way over there, which is ridiculous. Because it makes it harder for me to get them killed. Um, but at the very least, we can have them move up and pass off there. And, and we are going to want to have Jagen move in and do some shopping. And uh, we need some blizzards. And the thunder. I really should use Jagan more. I haven't been just because I don't know. Um, because and the reason I should use Jagan more is because the reason I should use Jagan more is he actually has like a little bit better strength growth than he does in Fire Emblem 1, where he has like 10 percent. I think he has like 15 or 20 here, which is like, oh my gosh, actually passable. In this shop we have, um, I think this was heals. Yeah, that doesn't count. I mean, there's vulneraries, but what's more important is that we come here and we buy a rapier. And there's only one, so that's the only one we get. It's the only one we get. Let's consolidate our weapons on one guy. Whatever. Um, and then let's actually... I don't want to deal with too many horsemen in an open field, so we're just going to choke point this... And everyone's just showing up. What a fun day. Uh, let's just finish shopping really quick while I can. I forget what else I need. None of that, for sure. And I think this one has Wing Spear, but Sheeta's not going to be a Pegasus Knight for the rest of the playthrough, so... Javelins are nice, though. I forget how many I have, and I'm going to regret buying two, but whatever. And I should have used Jaken for that. Whatever. We're, we're going to have Jaken skip to the boss. Because he's nice. I mean, it doesn't matter that much. Abel's just gonna be Abel, and which basically just means basically good. No, let's. It's always Drog. Put Drog there. Let's see if Jagan can actually dent the boss. It would be pretty annoying if he couldn't. Caesar's gonna move here and deposit his stuff. Am I out of steel swords? I might actually be out of it. well. Everyone has a steel sword. Wendell's is almost out. Um, I might buy another one, but later. As in, like, next turn. Am I missing anyone? Nope.
And of course everyone has zero damage, cause it's drug. Oh, one damage. How nice. Oh, reinforcements. Yeah, that's a problem. Five? Oh boy, and that's with silver. Oh wow. Well. Jagan's more or less served his purpose. So he's mostly just flying around and helping people out these days. Um, Norn can kill things, and that's great. Bars to kill this guy. Yeah, we're good. Out of the way first. Oh, the reinforcements are going to be a problem very soon. I think Norn's gonna level from this, and that's good. Norn continues to refuse to grow any... anything that is, uh, any sort of speed. I mean, no, not speed, strength. Which is annoying. Um... We're good. Zero, ha ha ha. And drug doubles because drug is weird. Drug just does what he wants. I think this is gonna start to get frustrating. Okay. The situation with everyone being here and me wanting to keep units alive! And all of them. Okay, okay never mind, that's not gonna help me. Any. But I can do this. Let's play a game, it's called Hope That Abel Doesn't Die. It's a terrible game. Sheeta! Might as well just use my silver lance. Cause why not? And then I'll buy another one at the point. These guys are dealing one damage to me, right? 
Uh, but then there's this horseman guy who is just barely out of range. So that's good. Um, yeah, no archers in range. Good enough. Let's just get some other guys out of the way that way. Abel's going to be hurting a lot, though. He only has 9 defense. Ooh, that's not good. 2, okay, okay. One damage, oh no! And then Jagan murders him. Because Silverland's OP. More people attacking Abel. More Abel killing everybody. Ooh, nice miss. Good, good. Wait, why am I supposed to be worried? These guys are weak and Abel is like OP right now, so... Oh look, he gained more strength. I swear, by the end of this playthrough, it's just going to be... Able. And kind. Okay. Um, better check your range. Oh yeah, I don't want to be in range anymore. I can do this. I am diverting the attention of half of... not half. A little bit of the army. Uh, that's not enough to kill, so I don't care. Fall back. Except she does she'll die if she keep if she heals up if she sticks her hands around. That's fine though, because we can always just do this. This and then Sheeta heals up Abel. Let's just use heal. And yeah. So here's Roger. Cool guy, but he only has an Iron Lance, so there's nothing that we actually care about uh, from him. He can be recruited by Sheeta, by Sheeta talking to him, and it is like the best support ever, but uh, we need EXP. We really need EXP. Anyways, one damage and zero damage. Good, good. Oh, I don't want. I don't like that. I don't like you being around. It's okay though. We'll just do this. Ha ha! Bye. Ah, uh, the rider's bait is great. Oh, it's better than nothing. Wow, oh, Roger has enough speed to not get doubled by bars. That's uh, something. So we'll just take pot shots instead. Still no magic. Uh, what can we do against Roger right now? Probably not much. Let's give Drog a little bit of EXP. Looks like he'll have enough to level 
just from working with this guy. Oh yes, this is one of those games where it's just like... I'm gonna end up leaving everyone in the dust because I'm just like refusing to let anyone get hurt. And that's a bad thing. Um, so let's see what I can do about that. Oh, off by one. That's rough. Wendell also just can't do anything. Marth, meanwhile... Let's use this. Yay, Marth gained more strength. Meanwhile, Julian's still at 7 because I just haven't leveled him. Let's see what we can do about that horse kid. Damn horse boys. I could do this. Let's actually, yeah. We get to see Bantu in action a little bit. Might as well gain some levels. Fire Dragon! And Roger is now on fire. Oh no, he is dying. It's a shame. He's really cool. Okay. I need to deal some scratch damage with Wendell first. Yeah, scratch damage is best for this situation. Uh, Wendell probably will end up getting benched as well. I don't know if that's like allowed, quote-unquote, because it's like, I'm not actually using them, but... Also, it's great that horsemen give like 3 billion EXP to unpromoted units. Alright, let's, we can start moving up now. I've wasted enough time dawdling about. Well, I forgot to change Penvo to a Cav. Oh, that makes me sad. I should. I was hoping the Horse Boy would come first, but no. That's fine. Ooh, I critted anyway. Uh, but then the ar other armor guy will show up anyways. Yeah, there it is. And this is all just wasted shots on my rider thing. I don't get too many of those. It's okay. Jagan can fly. Okay. What to do? What to do? Up, up. Someone needs to should engage with that cavalier if they can. Should I actually nominate Julian? Except he. Except whoever is attacked also gets attacked by this horse boy. They both have 14 attack. 
attack. That's 11 each. That's no good. Um, Bantu can probably survive, actually. So maybe I'll use Bantu. Nobody else is in range! Except for these guys, of course. Bantu's not even in range! Okay. Able it is. No, Kane. Just because he's slightly weaker. When will Julian get that s I really need to use Julian more so we can get C... C swords, so that he can actually use Armor Slayer and then actually be useful. Be more useful. Oh, I messed up. Whatever. And if I had put Abel there, it would have killed the horseman. Whatever. You're dead, though. Yep. Bye. It's cool, though, because the horseman not being dead means I get to just kill him with Julian for more EXP. And he levels again! Yay! Level, um... Give me some strength! I need my strength hacks! Uh... Whatever, let's poke for damage. Drog takes care of that. Kine stands here. There's only one horseman around, so I don't have to worry too much. For now, anyway. Because I want to use that house to lure the... Uh, I don't want to. I shouldn't be luring the other horsemen because that would be very bad for me. Here's Jagan. Still kind of chilling out. Let's go shopping. I need to. Purchase spare silver lance just in case. Cause without the silver lance, Jacob can't do anything. Oh. The sadness. And then Kain just butchers. Yet another cavalier. Of course, the horseman's going to attack Julian. Full health. Which is pretty crazy. Thankfully, oh no, where's my armor slayer? Did I forget to pack armor slayer? I swear. I'm dying right now. It was here all along. Just sitting there. And I didn't give it to Julian. I mean, Wendell. 
That can actually be fixed. It's not that hard. Just need to use the rapier. Further unit. For reasons. And we can move Wendell here. Use the convoy to retrieve the armor slayer. And then attack with the armor slayer and kill this guy and get him which is okay pokey poke Here so that he doesn't have to. Are there any horse boys in range? No? Okay, we're good actually. Oops, that's not Thorn. Uh, what about Cord? Can Cord do anything? Not enough. Okay. Move Kane here just to protect uh, Wendell a bit, and then we'll have Julian finish off this guy with our steel sword. Actually, kind of regretting forging that iron sword right now, but uh, whatever. Then we can heal Julian. Jake can go shopping. I think it's this one. Uh, no, it wasn't. It was the one one shop to the north. All the armorers look the same. What's up with that? Am I right? Just one silver lance. That's it. It's like I could be raising Jagan's axe rank. But I just don't have the time because he just does such low damage otherwise. And if I'm not killing someone outright to, as like ba quote unquote basically emergency, like killing someone, there's not really any point. And they attack Mars. Good for you. You're dead. Okay, I'm fine with this. Crit boys! Oh yeah, you're here. Oh, now they've been aggroed. Um... Cord is one off from killing this guy, and I hate it. Interestingly, no. Cord's not fast enough to kill that guy. Uh, I could just choke point again with Kane, or Abel, or Draug, but that's just like. I'm wasting so much EXP that other people need. Um, and yet I might end up doing so anyways. Cause... Well, we'll move Wendell.
Marth continuing to crit the heck out of everything he sees, apparently. More speed. Uh, oh, I should have used Bond too. Whatever. Abel, you're up. Except you're almost out of javelin charges. That's what we're gonna. Do. They're both out of ja nearly out of javelin charges. I'm actually gonna let them aggro on against Abel, or I can use the javelin. Javelins are great in this in this game anyway. Super fresh. And once again I end up denying everyone else who uh denying EXP to the people who need it. Ain't that grand. This dodge a bow, and then Julian, who I'm practically oh no 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 not iron shoot no 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 I got too ambitious. I got way too ambitious. Okay, I guess I have to kill you with Wendell. Which is like ridiculous in itself. Well, not ridiculous, but still kind of silly. But I need to get these guys, especially Penvo, who I didn't reclass, over to the boss so they can die. Die a sweet and painless death. Well, it's probably very painful. We uh, just don't know that. Uh, I think we need some vulneraries too. Ooh boy, missed. Ooh. Give me my kill. Julian's at one. It doesn't even matter. More speed, and still no strength. Why do these guys actually have resisted stats, man? Armored Sirius, like... Uh, let's poke around. Steel Sword. Okay, nine. See if I can kill him anymore. Nah, oh, that's that'll work. Uh, Barst. Barst will not kill. What about Norn? Norn will barely kill. Yeah, I got to get enough. Lots of EXP. Lots of EXP. Uh, don't want to get in their aggro range too fast. Or I could. Just 
set everybody up. More random heal staff usage. More drugs sitting in front of choke points. More Bantu sitting around because I refuse him. Just. Like, I don't know what's my problem with Bantu. He's on my team, might as well use him. And better have Jake and meet up with the rest of the gang. And then here's Drog just taking no damage from lots of things. And then I'll have to reclass him to Dark Mage and he'll lose like half of his games. Which is kind of... Today is a good day. All these lol prints. Bye. Let's give Bond to some experience. Yeah, he gets like eight defense or something when he transforms. Yeah, why not? Oh, also, he only uses one charge even if he double attacks, which is nice. One day, Sheeta, one day you will actually gain one point in magic. One point, that's all I ask. Just gotta get some poke damage in for fun. Oh boy! More reinforcements! Yay. It's okay, we can fight them off. Eventually. But I mean, we need to get our units killed first. Which is like the most messed up thing to say. But here we are saying it anyway. Oh yeah, but on the flip side for, for something like someone like Bantu is um if he gets attacked by like a ballista, he'll have to transform and then waste a charge, even though most other units with regular weapons don't lose any charge. But that's okay. Um better fall back. It'll help a little bit with dealing with things, I think. Or 
we're gonna heal Core first. Sheeta levels gains one luck. Yay. Let's just bring everyone around to this side. I'm gonna have to wait a few turns before Shiza dies, and then Rad dies, and then Tenvo dies. But he's going after Rad first. All right. Bonti's doing pretty good. It's just his, his bases aren't that great, and his growth rates definitely aren't that great. But I mean, I mean, uh, he'll probably put in work. Definitely to be need to be falling back, but I don't know how far I should fall back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 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 nine. So that's where the range is for that. So let's put Bantu right here for Trout is right now. And then move everyone else out of range. And we're basically retreating to the bridge. Slowly. Um, we need to absolutely make sure that, like, essential units like Sheeta are still alive, so... And Sheeta now has B in staves. Uh, we're good. What were you thinking? Doesn't matter, I was the one who just told you to stand there unarmed, which is like the stupidest idea ever, but whatever. And apparently the knight does not want to fight a dragon, because he does zero damage to the dragon. And then there's these horsey boys. How far back can I retreat? I'll probably finish off these guys first, it's no good. Able levels- oh, Kane levels once again. Gains more OP stats. We're just going to cut off access on that end. Barth can move across the river. Cheetah can heal Marth. Um, Julian can move across the river. Yeah, the... I mean, Julian's nice for scratch damage. He needs levels, but it's just like... I don't have the time right now, because I have to worry about... Yeah, this is good. For now. Attack Mars, get killed. Attack Mars, get killed.
Okay. I'm totally okay with that. I guess they like attacking Marth a lot. Ooh boy. Okay then. Hold your horses. I'm so funny. Huh. No doubling. What has this world come to? Frog will just soften him up. I'm probably making the worst kinds of decisions for any game, but who cares? This is gonna be a little more entertaining this way, I hope. Whee! All the EXP. I think that's about it. Mark back towards this way. If more reinforcements spawn, then we'll worry about them. We can just have... Uh, Wendell doesn't do anything even with an armor slayer! What's going on? That 15 defense is too strong. That's why we have bars. And again, Bars doesn't really do much, but it's better than nothing. That's a... not much damage. 15 defense early game, though. Nothing Julian does will do anything. Nothing Jagan does will have any meaningful effect. Honestly, I just have to use Marth. I don't know how else I'm gonna do anything. Yeah, just use Marth and he dies. Bye. Nice EXP. More strength gains. And the Leaven Sword. Alright, we're good here. It'd be nice if she'd have healed up people a bit more. Let's use one more heal charge, I guess. And then we'll finish the chapter. We're going to travel to Pirati. The king is supposed to be a Manikeet. Alright. Well, that's that for today. Um, stay tuned for the exciting chapter 9. Um, eventually. And so this has been Ace Master. Uh, leave them likes, comments, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!